Hey guys, happy Thursday, Urban Turban. Hope you guys are doing well. Hope your day has started abundantly. Hopefully your day has started peacefully. And hopefully your day has started full of faith and full of positivity. Here is the mantra of the day. Do not let yourself be intimidated. Do not let yourself be scared of happiness. A lot of times we are taught in society not to be happy. We are taught in society not to be proud. We are taught in society not to be confident. We are taught that there is something wrong with smiling. There is something wrong with having a great time. There is something wrong with being joyful. There is something wrong with being positive. Have you ever had a situation in your life where things are going really well and then you get really sad? Have you been on a great date or had a great vacation and then you get really sad? Or had a great project, you're an artist and you're working on a great project you're so passionate about and then sadness comes to you? It is because you're letting that, that negativity overlap such greatness in your life. And you have been so used to in your life people saying stuff such as, you shouldn't be happy. What's wrong? Why are you doing this? Why are you doing that? And it has embedded in your subconscious. So when things are going great and abundant, you almost sabotage yourself. You almost say, wait a second, hold it. I can't. I can't. I I can't be happy. I don't deserve this. I don't deserve this greatness. And you go back to the past, right? Your mindset goes back to the past. You start thinking about yourself in a negative aspect. For example, yesterday, I had a great day yesterday. I had an interview with the vice president of Oprah Winfrey Network, John Sinclair. He's the executive producer of Belief. I interviewed him and his, uh, by the way, his interviews could be on tonight in San Jose, San Francisco and Oakland, 1170 AM. My radio show, the Urban Turban Show tonight at 10 to 11. He's going to be on. Also, I wrote an article for Huffington Post about belief. Now, when I did this, after I did this, instantly my mindset went to me cleaning toilets I write in. Instantly my mindset went to me losing everything and almost committing suicide. It is crazy how you can have such abundance, positivity, talk to someone from Oprah, have your own radio show, write for the Huffington Post, and then all of a sudden your mind goes down. And you start feeling bad for yourself and sad. But you have to tell yourself you deserve the happiness in your life. You have to tell yourself you deserve to be proud of yourself. You have to tell yourself you deserve to be joyful. You have to tell yourself and really tell yourself there's nothing wrong with being abundant. Actually, there's everything correct and right with being abundant. There's nothing wrong with being proud. Actually, there's everything correct with being proud. There's nothing wrong with smiling. Actually, there's everything right with smiling. As I smile creepily to you. So realize this on your good days. There'll be days in your life where things are going great and do not sabotage yourself and put something from the past that really has no existence in the present to sabotage you. Another example, if you're on a date, if you're with a guy or a girl and things are going great and abundant, stop comparing this person you're on a date with with some idiot ex who didn't treat you well, with some idiot friend that didn't treat you well. With some idiot family member that doesn't treat you well. All right? Have fun in the present. Be abundant. Be proud. Be joyful. Smile. Enjoy. And really be proud of yourself. Abundance is the key to today. That is the mantra of the day. Abundance. Also, Urban Turban Radio Program. Tonight, 10 p.m. San Jose, San Francisco, and Oakland. The vice president of Oprah Winfrey Network is on. We're going to talk about belief. It is going to be a phenomenal interview. You don't want to miss it. Have a good day. Namaste, everyone. Namaste.